An unknown species of horror is born as science fiction becomes science fact. <laughs> They don't sting, and they're just all they're doing is looking for a little love. Cicada Maniacs are a group of graduate students and professors in the entomology and biology departments at the University of Maryland, and our job is to get people excited about the cicadas. The cicadas live as a nymph underground for about 17 years. In the spring of that 17th year, they're going to tunnel up to the surface and they're going to poke their head up through the surface. They're going to crawl up onto the tree trunks. They're going to basically do a backflip out of their shell. And then they're going to start moving to the treetops where they're going to engage in sort of courtship songs to attract the ladies. The song that we hear right now is the chorusing song. We sort of equivalent it to like a frat party where all the guys are hanging out, blasting their music, saying, hey ladies, come check us out. Once they get the attraction of a particular female, they'll change their song a little bit and they'll drop in tone. So they'll go, eh, 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 eh. And then of course, after about three bouts of, of sort of intense singing, they'll mate. Creature from hell, and nothing could stop it. Wherever you turned, the bug was waiting to push you beyond human endurance and leave you in a state of blood boiling fear. The bug lives, the bug grows, the bug brings you the ultimate experience in terror. You won't live alone if you live at all when the bug comes to your house. One man was determined to learn its secrets, to discover how it grew and what it needed to survive. insects they don't hurt anything they don't have any illness they don't have any sickness and also you can eat them because they have no fat whatsoever they have no cholesterol they are pure protein so it's something really 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 healthy Turn. Bon appétit. Come on, baby, 